Our ESPN Stats and Information Group created a formula to help predict who will win the Heisman Trophy. Keep in mind, the last six years, this has been exactly right. And it's, you can see this on ESPN.com. But entering this week, job and best eighth place right now. Tim Tebow leads the way. And in fourth, how about the super senior QB for Cincinnati? It's Tony Pike. And for more on him, here's Todd McShay. Cincinnati head coach Brian Kelly has one of the most underrated offensive systems in all of college football. I think he's finally found the perfect trigger man in Tony Pike to run it. Let's take a look at what makes Pike so special. You see here, he's a tremendous pocket passer. He loves getting the ball in the shotgun, surveying the field, and then driving it down the middle. To run this play back, you see a quick decision, the touch, and putting the ball right between those two soft spots in the zone. Now he also does a good job, Pike, of throwing the ball while on the run. They move the pocket sometimes, and look at Marty Gilliam working that corner out, the touch just dropping it in and leading him into the corner. Very nice throw. And then finally, how about this? 6'6", 220 pounds. The pocket presence, the quick feet, and throwing accurately on the run. Now, Cincinnati's off to a fast start. They play Miami of Ohio on Saturday. They have a bye week, and then it's the big showdown against South Florida Thursday night, October 15th. I think it could be a coming out party on the road for Cincinnati and Pike. All right, Todd, thank you much. Look at this week's AP poll. It's hard not to notice Cincinnati in there, number 10, and why not? A dominant defensive performance along with Pike's brilliance at quarterback leading them over Fresno State Saturday. How about Chris Spielman? What's your top five? My number one team is Florida. They're a talented football team. They will answer the challenges of the year, and I see nothing yet to tell me that they don't deserve the number one ranking. Number two, I have Alabama, a running football team, tough defensively and getting good quarterback play. Number three, I have Texas. Once Colt McCoy gets it going, he will bring the rest of the Longhorns with him. They'll play better as the year goes on. Number four, I have Cincinnati. Tony Pike is the best quarterback nobody's ever heard of. Ten returning starters on offense, impressive win at Oregon State. And number five, I have Boise State, another complete football team that plays with great confidence and plays with a chip on their shoulder. Wow, Cincinnati number four, but how about...